Miss Craft here, and I just wanted to give you a weekly overview um, of what the assignments are this week and how to use our template. I'm sure that a lot of you have become familiar with it because we used it last week, but I wanted to give you a quick overview and show you a few new things that we added. So <clears throat> hopefully this is the button that you clicked right here to see this video. Um, we have our schedule, and as you see on Wednesday, your child can do all of the activities under Wednesday. Um, this is not a must, we recommend it, but if your child would rather do one subject a day, that is fine too. Um, we just wanted to give you the option of um, keeping your child on some type of schedule throughout the day. So we'll go ahead and start. Anything that is underlined, this is reading and writing, and anything that is in blue and underlined, you can click on it. So this is one activity, and this is another right here. If you go to, let me click out of that. If you go to this Epic Books, and then um, your child should have, if, they don't, if they've done a Zoom with Miss Sheehan or Miss Pettijohn, they have learned that they can create an account using um, this login right here for Miss Sheehan or Miss Pettijohn. So again, right here on Tuesday, I'm sorry, um, our weeks are off. So this is Wednesday, this is Thursday. So on Thursday, they can click on this and then they can watch a brain pop video. This is the link right here. And then whenever they want to do their final assignment, they're gonna go back to Google Classroom and they're going to click on that reading graded assignment. So let's go ahead and look down here. Um, we are going to try to put some type of video right here to give you an idea of what you can do to help keep your child active. We um, encourage the eye station Tuesday and Thursday. It doesn't have to be. Um, actually, this is not. This is Thursday and Monday, um, but they can just pick whatever day they would like. This right here is um, we've heard that sometimes the links aren't working. Um, it's working for some, it's not working for others. I think it depends on your device, but you can always click on this link right here or in class, our Google Classroom, there is a Zoom uh, link as well. So the one thing that we're gonna add, I want you to see these blank blue spots. We are actually gonna add something right there. Under math, it is already added. So if you can see right here, it has Miss Craft and Miss Boudreaux's Zoom link. And then underneath is going to actually be a link of what we will be doing during Zoom that day. So your child can join us on Zoom and they can do this activity. If for some reason they missed our Zoom, then they can click on it and they can see what we went over during Zoom that week. Again, um, the, the graded assignment is going to be over here on the right. It is not clickable because we have to make one of those assignments for each child. And so that is an assignment in Google Classroom. So this is our math, we're watching a video. Um, we don't wanna forget about Study Island. Your child will know what, what this means if you tell them to work on 3.8a and 3.8b in Study Island. That is the objective that, working on, that we are uh, gonna be working on this week. Brain Pop video, if it makes you log in, then that's Wilson's username and password for Brain Pop. This is a quizzes game. We love playing quizzes. The students loved it. So they can go ahead and do that. And then also, I didn't want them to forget about their multiplication facts. And so this is their link to the multiplication facts. At the end of the week, they will go to Google Classroom and click on the math graded assignment and finish that. So that is really all. Um, you can see down here for math, we actually added a video. There's a video right here for Wednesday, and that is what we will go over during Zoom. So your child can watch that instead of doing Zoom, or they can come to Zoom and they can actually ask questions after we go over the video. And there should be one for every day. And then on Tuesday, we are going to actually review the graded assignment for those that still need a little bit of extra help. So that is about it. We have our class link. Don't forget that class link has a lot of resources available if your child is just wanting some more work. And I believe that is it. So if you have any questions, please just email your child's teacher and we will be happy to answer the best we can.